Hello everybody, welcome to part 3 of the Hobbs Grind. Let's get this bad boy started. And move him out of the freaking way. These are all the 20 freaking mixing stations in this row here that we have. Yep, and then there's the other building. Okay. So that's where all those slaughter weights and the pigs and stuff are. Actually, if I park this here, I think it might there be good for that. Let's go back here. Where are we sitting? Okay. We'll leave you right there. Let's see if you actually stay. Jump back over here into our load of cows. We'll get them moved because I don't want to leave them sitting on the trailers. I don't know if there's any glitches with them or not. So I don't want to try it. And then I'm going to turn this way just so I can keep moving. I would hook up, or I would unhook the other truck and hook up all six trailers, but I don't know if I can get six to that building, to that door around the corner there. I'm kind of afraid to try that. If I get them all caught in there, I'm screwed. Wool pellet selling. <clears throat> I think I need up over here. In here, maybe. Oh, we got a pitch. Maybe. Yes. Cool. Alright, so we've sold a load of... Wow, this is a curvy path out of here. Alright, so we sold a load. I know how to sell them now. Um, you're gonna see jumps in time. on here just for trying to uh, I'll 
also do stuff around the house while recording. So you're going to see some jumps in time on the server. The server is running to real time. Um, it is six hours and 15 minutes behind my time. Oh, I guess another point I should put out there um, is the server is only going to be open for a couple more weeks, and then we're going to be going to a different map. So stuff's going to be changing on here. This guy in here, turn it off for right now. That's it. Okay, that's him. Now we just sold those for a fourteen fifty four. And we'll probably see them go back up <laughs> before we get back to selling them again. Could be using you. Drop the cruise control so it's a manageable speed. I'm gonna go, just go around real quick, put him up. to the farm here. We'll go pick up our load of sugar beets. I think this is the first one that we had picked up. There we go. And here's kind of where we're sitting. We got 1.2 million corn, 2.1 million barley, 1,400 canola we're going to sell, 5.7 million wheat, 1.9 million potatoes, 1.5 million sugar beets, um, 207,000 grass. Why do we have grass up here? No straw. 7.2 million silage. And that's after I just moved. God, close to a million last night. We have no forage. Which all of us go to the cows. For the next ration, I guess. 17,000 chaff. And 1.3 million wood chips. Those are on the agenda to sell as well. So we're going to take this guy with our full load of sugar beets. We're going to run over to our 
I don't know if it's the cows or the pigs that take the sugar beets. But we're going to run a load over. Give them a load of this. Okay, I'm curious. Can I walk over here and get a description of what's... I cannot. So tell me. No. Well, oh, hello, pig. Ah. <laughs> I did not know they did that. That's liquid manure. Is there a trigger here for something? No? Okay. So how do I know? Hmm, I'll have to wait to see if we need to move grass into there or not. Okay, so I'm full on sugar beets, I guess. We'll go move that back. And then we'll pick up a load of mixed rations and we'll start moving it. Dump these back in the storage. Now we'll run over and 
to start the extraction process. Oh, there's a ring there. Okay, be careful not to drive under any triggers here. I'm always lagging here on the farm because of a sign that he put in. It's really laggy. Um, 16 minutes already. Wow. This is what I mean about this map. It's a... There's plenty of work. You'll never run out of work. I went in the first day I was able to play on this farm once I got everything loaded and stuff right. It was late at night, I played a couple hours, then went the next day and played 12 hours. I was in this map for 12 hours. Yeah, look at all the bunkers on the back of those things, they're all full. And they're all empty on stuff. We're gonna have to run some grass. Oh my god. Oh. Oh, I'll run this track just to kind of show you guys what the process is, and then we'll go put this one up in the next episode for the next part. Are you kidding me? This is going to be a mega run. You drive into the spout. You wait for it to fill. And one bunker is pretty much a trailer. And there's 20 of these. They're not all quite full, so we're not only going to get probably one and a half million out of this. There's three quarters of a trailer. Holy crap. I'm 5,000 short of getting a full load. And we're full. Alright, thank you. Thought I pressed that already. And all of these things are full. This is the absolute fastest. I want to go to be able to make corners right. All of these are loaded. That's. I may run a double or triple through this actually. And believe it or not, you can make a. I know at least a double because I've done it before. You can make a double through that farm. And that's going to be a process in itself. But you just do that, you come over here to the cow barn, roughly there, stop that, hit that, and you unload. Then the cow's productivity will start going up after a little time, and then we're going to go put this truck up. And then there's one back here, you can come, crank the wheel. Ooh, a little laggy there. Like I said, and normally I will take that at 10 miles an hour. That's what I do this entire run. And I might still do that, but I'm going to be running at double uh, or triple. I'm probably through it. Um. Whoa. 
what we're going to go run this guy and put him up. We're going to grab the other truck. We're going to put him away. And then we'll probably grab one of these triples up front here. And try him. This is one thing we try to do. We put everything back in order. You, this server, as the owner of the server has put it, constantly gets really good attention. Everything is kept in order. We even have power washers to keep stuff clean, and I'm going to do that eventually. Whenever I can have time, I'm not trying to take care of cows or something. But I do at least try to get something back. But yeah, we'll probably run this guy. Up there. I totally just glitched right through that. No, yeah, you can sell it. Down we go. And down we go. Now we'll see how soon we get eggs filled back up again. That's what we can look now to see what we're. Eggs in the backpack. 649. So. It's constant work on the farm, literally here. The nice truck there. What is in here? <laughs> a toxic cover. Jesus. That's tall. Okay, how in the heck do you stack bags at all? But anyway, this is running long. This is a 25 minute uh, <laughs> part, I guess. I mean, we still gotta go in. There's like one and a half million of the extraction to move. There's all the fields of grass need mowed, and then the grass needs picked up. Um, which takes a while. That's, that's some big fields. Uh, all of these the silage is 
at 12, the hay is at 12, the straw is at 34, it holds 50,000 of each on every one of these. You can see the meters on how empty they are. So we're going to have to run that. We're going to Harvesting needs done. That double trailer holds, I think. Yeah, five, ten holds twenty. How many got? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Well, wait, there's three rows. Eight, sixteen, seven, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. Yep, we can get a full load of pallets. Are ready to be hauled off, and that's what those forklifts are for. Um, we're running at uh, what else? Ready? Oh, that's what that field is. That is already barley. Okay. But yeah, that's a huge field. So that one's a good size, that's decent size, good size, a little bit bigger, huge. They turned that into a big field. And so it's, and that's ready to be finished harvesting, that's ready to finish harvesting, that's ready to harvest. Of course, the mowing is just lots of stuff to do. I'm going to end this one here. I'm going to go get a couple things done. I'll probably close out, just get this uploaded, and then and then I'll probably get back on and we'll go at it again. So. See you in the next part of the grind.